Judge of a district court in Dallas County was in Big Spring today. Stacey Williams running for place seven in the Texas Supreme Court. Good evening, I'm Eddie Flores. Big Two's John Kim had a chance to speak with the candidate and she joins us now with her answers to some hot topic questions. Hey, John. Well, good evening. Williams tells me she has over 10 years of judicial experience. Now, this is in addition to 27 years of legal experience. She tells me the Texas Supreme Court needs to start looking more like the state of Texas. It needs to represent diversity as well as the working class. We want someone with experience. Judge Stacey Williams made a stop in Big Spring Monday. She's a two-term judge of the 101st District Court in Dallas County. I'm running for the Texas Supreme Court because it's time that we have people who are qualified and experienced. Williams currently handles various cases such as commercial, medical malpractice, real estate, and oil and gas disputes. She says with her diverse background of expertise, she can bring real-world experience to the table. Not only am I a two-term district court judge, I've been an administrative judge for the Equal Employment Opportunity Committee a municipal court judge for the city of Dallas. While she identifies as a Democrat, she says judgeship should transcend party lines. She's running on two promises, fairness and due diligence. So whether or not you're a Democrat or Republican, conservative or liberal, you want someone who's going to give you a fair shot. She says the lack of diversity in both experience and viewpoints is a shortfall. The Texas Supreme Court has consisted of all Republicans for two decades. Williams now calling for holistic representation. Most of them have not been elected. They've been appointed by the governor. And you know, when we start actually electing all our Texas Supreme Court justices, they're going to begin to look like the state of Texas. They're also be going, beginning to look like working class people. The primary election is on March 3rd and the primary runoff will be on May 26th. Reporting in Big Spring, I'm Jian Kim.